simple life. Something about those aches and pains from working on the farm. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Eric, and today we're taking a look at this. I have decided to kind of try to up my game in the very near future. You should be able to hear my voice a lot better on these uh, on these videos because I'm getting a wireless mic. But today I wanted to show you this. This is also uh, an upgrade to the game. While I have the main camera that you're watching this video on, I want to be able to film stuff in you know, tight spaces and and things where perhaps it would get dirty or perhaps it would be a little bit narrow. This is an action camera, like a 4K camera here. This is the SJ Cam. It's the SJ 4K. And uh, I hope that it lives up to the hype. I'm sure it will, but I did a lot of research before getting this thing, and it's pretty cool. So it is uh, waterproof, which is really neat. So a lot of times you see me wrap up videos real fast because it starts raining. Well, I won't have to worry about that. I'll use this camera in those kind of conditions. You can actually take the thing underwater, from what I understand. But let me flip it over. We'll go over some of the stuff that it says it does. 4K, 30 FPS, frames per second. And record wonderful, clear videos at any time. It says 170 degree wide angle lens. That's one of the main reasons I also picked this up, was not just for its waterproofness, but the fact that it's wide angle. So if I'm like underneath the car trying to show you something or underneath the uh, mower trying to show you something, a lot of times with the cell phone, which is flat, you know, it's tinier than the real camera. It just, you can't, you can't see much because it just doesn't show enough of the angle. It's not high enough above it. So that's kind of cool. 30 meters is waterproof. So you could literally take it swimming with you. And, uh, it says download files onto the mobile app or via Wi-Fi. So you don't even need to hook it to a computer. You can transfer it via Wi-Fi, which is kind of cool. It does have a rechargeable 900 milliamp hour removable battery. So that's kind of cool. So let's go ahead and open it up. I'll leave a link as to where I found this thing. I got it online. But um, it was uh, it was a really good price, to be honest with you. So let's uh, see. I guess I'll show you that. SJ4K Black. smaller than I thought it would be. I thought it would be a little bigger than that, but very cool. And of course, I've also ordered something else that I've got for this is um, like a, a harness. So you can wear it on your chest and that allows you to, uh, you know, to go hands-free. So a lot of times also while I'm working on something, you're trying to do it with one hand holding the camera and the other. It's very difficult. Well, with this and a chest rig or a head rig, you can do the work without having to get your hands, uh, you know, having to give up one of your hands, which is pretty darn impossible sometimes. So here's the uh, unit, and it comes in that waterproof case. Looks like that case pops open, and there's a little open tab, right? So, and then we have some buttons here. That's a button, and it looks like those two are buttons there. Oh, yeah, the front one. So those are all waterproof buttons that it comes with. Oh, it's already turned on. Oh, okay. Well, we'll go ahead and run with it then. Yeah, so there it is. So here it is at, uh, looks like 2K 30 FPS. There's a battery life indicator. And there is, uh, microphone is on. And I would say that probably tells us that it's not recording if I press the button. Oh, I need to add a card to it. That's right. So I'll grab a card. It takes mini SD cards. You can see there's your charging port or transfer port. All right. So let me go ahead and turn it back off. So that front button apparently is that. I'll just set it aside because I do want to go through the rest of this stuff. It does come with like a carry bag, which is kind of nice, like felt. That's kind of cool. But let's check out what else we got in the box here. Accessories. All right, so looks like we've got a couple of different stands for it. So I'm get those out. Yeah, I've been kind of looking forward to this thing. I, I'm getting, I'm actually going to use it here in about 15 minutes. I'm going to be rebuilding a carburetor for the other channel. And I uh, wanted to film that whole, whole thing. And, and instead of having to like try to get it at a weird angle, I'll do the top down wide angle. Now, there's a lot of connectors for it. All right, here's a battery. Wow, so it comes with two batteries. I did not realize that when I purchased it. So that's kind of nice that it comes with a second battery if you're out doing stuff. You know. They call it a sports camera or action camera. So like, I guess, you know, if you're, I don't know, skateboarder or something like that. You wanted to do stuff. You'd be out there all day filming. You know, this will allow you to do that. Just come with a nice long, wow, yeah. Nice three foot or four foot USB cable. Nice. 
And then here's our little charger. It has places for both batteries so you can recharge both at the same time. It's also cool. I assume, but I'm not positive, that you can charge by plugging into the USB and charge that way as well. Right? Oh, okay. So here's two mounts to, uh, if you want to hook it to a stationary place, like the dash cam type setup or, you know, for car racing, that kind of stuff. And then a couple of extra 3M sticky things for you. And hey, cool. Comes with some stickers. And then the manual and a cleaning uh, towelette. That's a pretty good looking manual, too. And I'm going to need to read through all this, but. Um, so you have resolution wise, we'll go through just some of this stuff and we'll go through all of it, but you know, 4K, 2K, 1080, and then we can also do 720 at 60, uh, 60 frames a second if you want to catch something faster. And VGA even, really, wow. So that'd be really long recording, I imagine. Loop recording, time lapse is cool. That is probably something else. I wish I had that uh, last month when I was doing the concrete. I could have done a time lapse of that. One hour of video equals one minute of playtime. That is really cool. Timestamp, burst mode, 40 megapixels if you want to take still frames with it. Awesome. Then you have an app you can download to transfer it directly to your phone. Since I don't use my phone for uh, video editing or posting or anything, I will, uh, I will not be using that, but I'll just download it directly to the, uh, my computer. So here's all our adapters that came with. Waterproof case, waterproof base case, <laughs> waterproof case buckle, waterproof cover. All right, and then we got a round head, round head bracket, round adapter. We have helmet base. Okay, so these are for gluing to a helmet. Interesting, if we wanted to do that. And you got another adapter, short adapter, vehicle adapter, data cable, stickies, and the claw. Pretty cool. And it is full color, which is really neat. Uh, flotation buddy so it will sink apparently without having some kind of an air bladder attached to it so that's something to be be, be advised of if you're gonna go like deep water <laughs> and then we got a wrist strap chest strap and a single shoulder strap so I would these would probably be the ones I would look into for for what I do here so that's something that they do seem to offer. That's pretty cool. 13 pages, full color in English. So really nice. Okay. So here's our little SD card. I got a 32 gigabyte. Slide that in this little corner piece here. And there it is. It's inserted. Cool. So let's go ahead. We'll put it back in here. You can see that case. Well, I guess while it's out, we'll take a look at what it looks like without the case there. Volume up and down. A little speaker here. OK button and light, power on and off, and then SD card and USB charging, or USB transfer too, probably. All right, we'll slide it back in this. Nice waterproof case. I, that's so cool. I don't think I've ever had anything that had a waterproof case in it before. All right, to seal it. And that's it. Okay, now the next thing I need to do is hook this up. Okay, for me, I'm going to switch it over to, let's see, it'd be this one, I think, yeah. Because I want to hang it upside down so I can watch what's going on. So I won't be mounting this to a uh, helmet because I'm, I'm not that cool. But I am going to be mounting it above my workbench so that I can show what's going on and show what I'm doing here. So that's going to sit like that looking down. All right, we are ready. So let's go ahead and see just what it can do. Till next time, my friends, this is the SJ Cam, SJ 4K Action Cam, and uh, I hope it works out. I hope it's cool. It definitely looks cool, and I have no doubt like it, it's got that good feel to it. So, take care.